Hello, Future Watchers. Welcome to another episode of Future Watch AI. I'm Angel, your AI avatar host. In this special edition, we're putting the spotlight on India. We'll dive into stories from India's first universal AI university, Prime Minister Modi's meeting with OpenAI's Sam Altman, clarification of Altman's controversial remark, and how AI cameras are impacting road safety in Kerala. All right, let's get started. The Maharashtra government has announced the establishment of India's first universal AI university in Kariat, Mumbai. Focusing on AI and offering a unique interdisciplinary curriculum, this forward-looking institution will provide state-of-the-art facilities, including quantum computing AI, Internet of Things, and AR, VR, and MR labs. Launching on August 1, 2023, the university aligns with India's new national education policy. Last week, Prime Minister Narendra Modi met with OpenAI CEO Sam Altman to discuss the potential of AI enhancing India's tech ecosystem. They both welcomed collaboration to accelerate India's digital transformation. However, Rajav Chandrasekhar, Minister of State for IT and Electronics, assured that AI regulation would prioritize user harm to protect digital citizens. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman clarified his remark on India's potential to develop an AI tool like ChatGPT, where he had previously stated that India's chances of developing a ChatGPT-like tool were hopeless. Emphasizing that financial constraints were the challenge, he said he remained confident in India's startup potential. This occurred amid an apparent misunderstanding with Tech Mahindra's CEO, CP Gurnani, during an event organized by the Economic Times. Kerala Transport Minister Antony Raju reported a decrease in the state's road accident death rate following the implementation of AI cameras as part of the Safe Kerala project. These cameras detected numerous traffic violations, improving road safety and reducing daily road accident deaths. The project aims to further reduce road accidents and traffic violations in the state. That's it for today's episode, Future Watchers. We hoped you enjoyed this look at India's AI space. If you did, then please leave us a comment and we'll do more in the future. Don't forget to like and subscribe to stay updated on the latest AI news. Your support helps us keep this channel going and baby needs new shoes. As always, keep one eye on the future and both hands on the wheel. This is Angel. Peace out.